there. This is one fan and and yes, I know I'm using Shuribi. And I am going to say what mangas I have. I'm just using one book from every series I have. But the problem is most of my books, I have only one book of the series, so there's a lot of them. So please bear with it. The first one I have is Fairy Cube. This is the only one I have of the series. It's volume two. I've yet to read volume one, but it's really good of what I have read. It is by Kaori Yuki and was published by Shoujo Beat Manga. And my friends actually get creeped out by this cover for some odd reason. Next one I have, I really love the manga, but you better not ever watch the freaking anime. And it's like, this. it's Chibi Vampire by Yuna Kagasaki. She's actually writing another series right now called Ion, and it's really good, but I've read so far, so far of it. And here's Maka Karen, the main character, the vampire. Oh, well, that's a perfect page to open up to. Anywho, back, and, um, can't remember his name. Usui. I haven't read Usui, yeah. Kenta Usui. And, actually, this is the first manga I ever bought in my lifetime, after I found out what manga was. The next one, my genius sister got me. She got Hayate the Combat Butler. I liked the anime, and she got me volume 10 of the entire series. Well, that's the only one they had. <laughs> well, that's genius. Well, you liked it. True. It was very funny. Kenjiro Hata, but I had no idea what was happening in the because I didn't finish the anime. So I still have to finish that to find, figure out what happened, but oh well. And yes, my sis my genius sister did get me this for my birthday. Next one is very funny to me. It's Fall in Love Like a Comic. Again, this is my only one I have. This is the only volume I have of this series. There's only two, but my friends still think there's a third, and it's very funny hearing talking about it, because I'll be like, let's find the third volume, and it's like, there is none, genius. It's by Chitose Yagami, it's by Shoujo Beat. Again. You would. I know I would. My sister's saying, like Yagami, and I'm like, I hate Death Note. I like Death Note. He's psychotic. Shh. Okay. Shut up. And yes, a romantic comedy for Shoujo manga fans. Ew, Shoujo. Oh, shut up. Next one. Is case closed, and that is Conan slash Jimmy by Gosho, Gosho Ayama. This is volume 35. We have a bunch of other ones, but I just like the cover of this one, so that's why I picked to put this one out. We have number 5 and like 31 to 38 or something like that. It, it, this one is published by Shonen Sunday, and there, they had another, had Viz another, Media. yeah, Viz Media got them later, so, yeah. And I think that's supposed to say Conan, but I know that last kanji there says death, Shen. So I have no idea what the heck it's supposed to mean then. This is the Great Detective Conan. There's only three kanji. Kanji. Katakana or Hiragana, whatever, genius. Anywho, next one is Vampire Night. I love the anime, and so I have a bunch of the manga, even though some of them are after the anime. By Shoujo Beat Manga. If you're going to notice something about my collection, a bunch of them are by Shoujo Beat or Viz Media. By Masari Hino. This is volume 1, but we also have volume 2 and like 9 through 11. And yes. And I'm just gonna skip ahead because right now on my iPod it is playing the theme song of the anime. I'm gonna actually turn it up. And I. Uh, DN Angel, volume 7 by Yukiru Sugisaki. And when I bought this, my mom actually thought this was a girl, and she told me to draw her. Her. And I'm like, that's a guy. <laughs> and this is my favorite anime so far. And there's Daisuke and Wiz. I think that's a new- it was, I got confused with Daisuke and I was like, they said whiff, and I'm like, is it Wiz or whiff? Make up your mind. And in this manga, this is the arc when he gets stuck in the painting, and Dark has to act like him for a week. That was very interesting. And yes, it is rated teen, tw 13 up fantasy, da 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 And it was by Tokyo Pop. That is also another polisher I have a lot of, Tokyo Pop. And I love their theme song, that's why I have it on my iPod. Next one, also, it is by the top shoujo writer in the world right now, Arena Tanamura, the Gentleman's Alliance Cross. 
And this is volume one. I also have volume two, but that's about it. Here's Kamiya. I just I know that's her real last name. I can't remember her first name at the moment. By Shoujo Beat Manga again. It is teens, older teens, and it was written and published by Viz Media. And, oh, Hain was her name. Hain. And also the one who wrote Full Moon. Next one, also by Irina Tanamura, Sakura Hime. Uh, this one's still being written. I also have volume four. A very good one. The Legend of Princess Sakura. And of course, this is Sakura. Back. It's for teens. And it was also. It was by Shoujo B and Viz Media, so. Doubled there. And it is very. Very interesting. Next one, I think pretty much everyone in the entire world has heard of, or, or at least seen the character, Naruto. This is the only volume again I have of it by Masashi Kimishimoto. Um, published by Shonen Jump. I think it was one time published by Shonen Saturday Sunday. I can't remember. I can never get all these facts straight in my head. And. This book reads from right to left, because apparently 13 years ago, that wasn't very common. The worst client. And there's Naruto, Sasuke, and Sakura. For team. The next one's pretty old. Um, Inuyasha. And the, I love the anime, but the manga just seriously annoys me, because it is unfortunately Americanized. And that just seriously annoys the heck out of me, so. Kagome, Inuyasha, and the Lady Centipede and all. And yeah, written by Rumiko Takahashi. Volume 1, I also have volume like 20, 31, something around there. By Viz Media for older teen. Next one. There is also an anime for this one, and it's Chobits by Clamp. I really like Clamp. I have probably watched at least three of the animes by her, him, I'm not even sure. By Tokyo Pop again. I have volume one, and then I also have the Onibus for volumes one through three. And here's Chi. Back. The Onibus for Chobits is half the series. Oh, yeah. And it's for older teens. I don't think I really fit in there, but still. Science fiction. Yeah, it should be rated M. It's not that bad, okay? Next one is Cherry Juice. This is the only, again, the only volume I have of this. It's volume three. There's only three volumes in the entire series, so I kind of got the ending in this, I think. I think there's only three. Let me check. Does it say the end at the end? I don't think so. I think there's more to it, but I've... As far as I know, there's only three. There's probably more, but so far I know there's only three published. By Haruka Fukushima. And it was published by Tokyo Pop again. Rated for teens, 13 and up. And is considered romance. And if anyone knows what the heck this series is, because I'm... Every time I see the back of this one, it always bugs me. I'm like, what the heck? What series is this? This Kodomo Demono kind of sounds like something. I don't know. Sounds like kimono to me. <laughs> Next one is I just bought this one yesterday, like the other day, really, at the flea market. Angelic Lair. This is only volume I have. Volume two by Clamp again. Again published by Tokyo Pop. And all ages, so it's not bad or anything. Cardcaptor Sakura, I love that series. I watched the entire anime. I it was sad at the end when he had to leave, but anyway, so I'm gonna get off it. And Hikaru and Saki, Chi. <laughs> and yes, the next one also by Masari Hino, the same as Vampire Night, is Captive Hearts. And the guy. I have not, I read this one like a few months ago, so I can't really remember the names of the characters. But I remember this one was very silly and had a lot of shorts at the back. So, let me see. 
Let's see if I can find any on the first try. Ah, crepe. This camera keeps falling. Uh, before it took hold me. Suzuka was the girl's name, and she's like Chinese. She came from China. Megumi. Yeah, I got confused. I'm looking through these pages trying to find the names, but I don't remember them all. Oh well. It is for teens, published by Viz Media. And it's kind of sad in this picture. When I looked at it in the store, I'm like, what the heck? Oh yeah, also by Shoujo Beat. So again, by two, like in Vampire Night. Next one, it does have an anime. But, and I do have two volumes of this. This is like, just about all about Sasumi. I'm, I still think the characters in this got ripped off when they made Magical Girl Sasumi or whatever it's called. By Hitoshi Okuda. And Sasumi. Washu, and I've completely forgot all the other characters' names. Tenchi, I remember his name. And yes, I did not want to show my other volume because it had a very weird picture on it. Volume, volume 2. And last but certainly not least is my favorite of all mangas, and I really hope it soon becomes an anime, is Kitchen Princess by Natsumi Ando. Well, the manga is by Natsumi Ando, but the story is by Miyuki. Kobashi, and it was also the creator of Zodiac P.I., which is also another good series, but did not have any of the manga. This is volume one, the only volume I have, but I'm totally nerded out on this series. I read the whole thing in a week, and I usually don't do that because I usually don't have enough time. There's um, Daichi Sora, and it is rated teen. Kodanchi and Del Rey did this too, and it does not say what genre would be considered. On the back, that's weird. And yes. And so that is the end of my video. Thanks. Thanks a lot for watching. Goodbye.